good morning ladies and gentlemen look what we got here this morning so I just woke up to some new car parts in the mail look at that are you guys ready to open it let's do it so I want you guys to comment below what you guys think these parts are let's see well let's put them down here first We'll put this one here. Let me let me go get a knife first. All right, let's get this open. All right, all right. Woo. The moment of truth. All right, let's see. Uh oh, look what we got here. Woo. Weld racing, baby. Oh my God. So excited. Wow. Shout out to Weld Racing. Now, I'm gonna tell you guys something cool about Weld Racing before I show you guys the wheels. So here's what happened guys. So when you buy Weld Racing wheels, they are literally built to order. So you gotta submit your order. They go through all the things so you can get a perfect fitment on your car. So you submit it and you know, you can call them and talk to them or you can order them online. And after that, it takes 68 weeks to build them. Okay, that's just normal for everyone. I talked to so many people, so many other people with Hellcats that told me they literally take every bit of eight weeks. And well, I leave to LA here pretty soon and a few weeks, a couple weeks actually, and I was like, okay, so I need them in. Like, this it's just, I, I'm, it's not gonna, it's, they're not gonna come in in time. I gotta figure this out. So I pick up the phone, call them, and I was like, hey, you know, I'm a YouTuber. If you guys can, you know, send them out a little sooner than that, I really will appreciate it. And they're like, no problem, we'll, we'll work something out and get it done. So hung up, just waited. I didn't think they would come in as quick as they came in. They came in in two weeks. They built them and shipped them. They literally came here on a weekend. Like, like I, I don't know how they were able to do that, but I, like, I, I appreciate them so much for literally building them and sending them out in two weeks. So shout out to Weld Racing, honestly. They have the best wheels on the market, which is why I went and bought some because they are literally the best you could go with. There's a lot of other companies, but if you want the best of the best, you gotta spend a little money like I did, okay? I used to have you know all the other brands and I've tried every other brand. They're a little cheaper. They're just not as good as these ones. You actually gotta spend a little bit of money for a good wheel setup on your car. So with that being said, let's check the wheels out. So let's check them out now, man. They look so awesome. I got this little sticker. Okay, here's the wheel. Let me let me actually open this up first. Whoo! Oh my god, let's put this on the couch. Look at it. It's so beautiful. Oh my god. Attention. You mount them, you own them. <laughs> Thanks for that. But here it is, man. Look how awesome it is. I love how it's like a deep dished look to it. And it's black here. Weld forged. I mean, look at them. I don't know. I don't know. Not too much to say about them. They're made in USA, obviously. Let's put it here. So here it is. Looks amazing. It says a 17 by 11. Okay, because I do have a wide body, so I needed the 11. So let's see what else we got in here. So here's our center cap. Um, here's some other, whatever, we don't need that. Let's open this one now. Put them next to each other. They're super light, by the way. Bam! Here they are. This is my rear setup for the red eye. Honestly, they are so beautiful. Like, just look at them. I don't know. I love drag racing wheels, and these are these are it, man. Look how awesome they look. And just look how wide they are. Like, let me put them this way. Look how wide this thing is. That's super wide. And my favorite part about them is the deep dish. Like, I gotta show you guys this way. Like, it's, that's weird, the reflection is messing things up, but 
Look how wide it is. Look at that. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. What do you guys think of these Weld Racing wheels? They are the best of the best, okay? I cheaped out on wheels before, but this time I told you guys I'm gonna do the red eye the right way, and I had to go with these bad boys. These are just super epic wheels. And I was going to get the beadlock version of those, but they were $1,200 a piece without tires. So, uh, was that a smart investment to do? No. So I decided to go with these. The other ones aren't gonna make me much faster. They're literally almost the same things, except they're about $600 a piece. Actually, like, not $600, $550 a piece more than these ones. So I decided to save some money so we could use that money somewhere else on the build and just get these ones. Let me show you guys one more time. <sighs> beautiful wheels, beautiful wheels. I'm so happy that they came in this fast. Two weeks, guys, two weeks. Shout out to Weld Racing, honestly. They came through big time and made it happen for me. One last look at them. I'm in love with them. The black here, the chrome here. Just perfect, they're just perfect. But now I actually gotta put them back. Look at the, look at the mess I just made. back in the box and also of course we can't mount them without tires I know I know we have some tires coming in today they will be on today's video I got to show everything to you guys in this video and uh, the tires are just epic honestly just wait till you guys see the tires the tires are the best tires you can put on a red eye or a demon wide body anything wide body this is the best setup you could possibly put I see so many other people out there, unless you have a 15 inch conversion, they start putting 18 inch wheels, they start putting 305s, they start putting all these random setups that just won't work out, I promise you guys, this is the right setup. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to hop in the Ram and we're going to go and pick up some wrapping materials, yes, we're going to get some vinyl because why? Hmm, should I tell you guys? Okay, I'm gonna tell you guys. And it's because we are wrapping the red eye, okay? We're gonna make it look so cool and totally different from anyone else. I know I have the super nice rare color, but now it's time to make it my own. I'm gonna put my little touches on it and it's gonna look super epic, so just stay tuned. You guys are not gonna see it coming on what I have planned. It's gonna, it's gonna be different than usual and um, if you guys have any suggestions on what I should do, let me know in the comments below. If you have any ideas of what I'm going to do to the red eye, let me know in the comments below. So now, let's hop in the ram and get going. Let's get in these bad boy. All right. Hey ram. Love the big screen by the way. My favorite thing on this car. All right guys, we are here at the wrap shop where we're going to pick up our wrap. Um, let's park here. So I'm gonna go in there and get the wrapping, and I'll be back and I'll maybe show you guys what I got. What do you guys think? What do we go with? Okay. So you got three of them. That's sick. It shows you how to look on cars. Ooh. That's clean. It's like three different colors, so. But. Did you find my last? Okay, I looked. Alright. Oh, Let me know. What do you guys think we went with? And here we got my truck, so we're gonna hop in the truck for right now. 
And we'll talk about that. It's literally as long as this truck. So as you guys can see, the video is in black and white. I'm obviously not gonna tell you guys. You gotta be a surprise, come on. I can't just let you guys know what we're doing with the car. It's gonna be super awesome, it's gonna be super sick. So just stay tuned for that. And also, as I told you guys, I'm gonna go out and see Street Speed. We're gonna link up with him. I really wanted my car to be done by then, but unfortunately, it won't be done. And I don't wanna rush it, because if I rush it, then I won't be able to make as many videos and I have to just, it's not gonna work out because my car is still at the shop, okay? And the wheels, I have to install them and the tires and they didn't come in yet, the tires didn't come in yet. And also welds didn't send the lug nuts, so I had to buy some and overnight them. So once they come in, I have to take them to Lydio, we're gonna have to install them and then he has to go out and test the car because I want the car to be ready and I wanna make sure it shifts right. I wanna make sure everything is good and we can't really test the car out with bad tires. I'm leaving in a couple days and I can't wrap the car, install wheels and tires, have Lydio test it all in, in, a, in a couple days. This is not gonna happen. So I'm gonna have to wrap the car once I come back from seeing street speed. Unfortunately, this has gotta go that way. Another thing we're about to go do is get an oil change for the truck because it needs it and we're gonna go on a little road trip so you, you know you want to make sure all the fluids are right all the oil is good and yeah so we're gonna go get that done all right so we're pulling up baby let's get it done so it's that simple now they're getting it all done while I just chill in my car another cool thing they do is they check all your tire pressure make sure all that is okay like mine weren't at 40 psi they just put them all on 40 psi so it's just it's the best. Thank you. You see how simple that is? Honestly, literally, I know the video doesn't show. It literally took five minutes, guys. Five minutes, we're done. But anyways, right now I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna edit a video that's going live today. Well, not today, a few days ago. And uh, that's the video I'm gonna go edit. And in the meantime, I'm gonna wait for my, my tires to come in because I wanna show you guys the tires. So they should be coming in anytime. I know they were out for delivery. So those come in today. And then tomorrow my lug nuts come in. And once those lug nuts come in, obviously I'm gonna go uh, mount them and have Lydia go test it. So that's gonna be the video that will drop probably tomorrow. So just stay tuned for that one. I literally just got home and the FedEx truck is here. I think my tires are here, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> So boom, here it is. We got a Mickey Thompson 315 by 50 by 17. The best tire in the game for a wide body, red eye, or a demon. This is the best thing you could do right here. You can't go any better than this. Unless you have a 15 inch conversion and you're running 15 inch wheels. But these are 17 inch wheels and these are the perfect tires for them. Guys, just look at them. Oh man, I shouldn't have done that. Look at all that meat, paused. Look at all that. Yeah, this is gonna go on the red eye. Just, just look how wide these tires are. We're gonna put these on in tomorrow's video. So anyways, stay tuned for the videos. A lot of cool content coming up, and also we leave to LA pretty soon. I, I'm sorry, I keep reminding you guys in every video, but we are leaving to LA. We're gonna link up with a lot of people out there, so just stay tuned for that. The red eyes obviously getting wrapped. So many things are happening. I know, I know. So many things are happening. So just stay tuned for all of them. But now it's time to let you guys go. Got so many things to do. I gotta go edit, do a bunch of stuff for you guys. So if you guys like today's video, give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, smash it. You know what? Baby.